Hi, um, I'm Tom from Falls Village Flower Farm. I'm here at our bocce corp that we have available for, for rental. And I'm here to explain the, the rules of bocce. So uh, the game consists of uh, two teams, one, two, or, or four players. And uh, each team has four, uh, four bocces, a red team and a green team. And then there is the um, polino, which is the target ball. So the object of the game is to get your bocce balls closer to the polino in order to score points. Uh, only one team can score uh, points during uh, each frame. So the game starts off with a toss of a coin. Once um, the, the team who wins uh, the toss uh, gets to choose between um, throwing the polino out and starting the game or the color of, of, of the ball that they're, they're to use. The, the first player of the team that won the toss um, throws the polino out. Uh, the polino needs to go past certain marks uh, on the um, bocce court. Uh, the second mark from the end that they're playing from, it has to go past that mark. And then there is uh, a second mark from the other end uh, that it can't go past. And then also cannot be within 12 inches of, of the board. So that's the area that the polino needs to land in. Uh, that player that threw the polino out throws his bocce ball out, um, trying to get it as close to the polino as possible. And that team is now considered in, meaning that their, their bocce ball is closer to the, the polino. Um, the second team uh, is now up and they uh, attempt to get closer to the polino in order to be considered in. Um, it's always it's an advantage to be in because you sit down and the other team is, continues until they, they get closer. Um, it's always an advantage to be the last one to throw your bocce balls. Alrighty. So once all the bocce balls are thrown out, um, you go down and you take a look um, at the uh, arrangement and see which one's closer. Right here we have um, a, uh, a frame that was thrown out. So here's the target ball. And right now, what we have here is we have this red ball here that is closer to the polino. Um, the next closest ball is the green one here. So uh, this green one here eliminates these three red ones from scoring. So for this frame, red gets one point. So um, that's marked on the scoreboard. Uh, the two teams go to the other end of the uh, court and play the second frame from, from that end. The team that uh, scores the points of the previous frame gets the um, advantage of throwing the polino out for the second frame. And you continue on until you reach your the points that you had determined what you're going to be playing to um, at the beginning of, of the game. We do have uh, a measuring device that can be used. It's put, it's put over top of the polino and you can use it to see which one's closer. Uh, you go to the front, front face of the, um, the bocce balls. So we've got this nice court down here uh, to be uh, rented. Uh, we've got a Weber, Weber grill to do some um, barbecuing if you really want to make a good day of it. Bring your family and friends down and um, have a great day. Thank you.